Arrest and conviction of a man in Shepherdsville left more than 100 animals to fend for themselves, like dogs, cats, rabbits, pigeons, and goats, and a mess left behind. Neighbors tell WDRB's Richard Essex they are relieved the animals and the tenant are both gone. The guy that was renting this property had no trespassing signs all over the place. He doesn't want anybody on the property. Until earlier this week, this was the home of dozens of cats, dogs, pigeons, chickens, and small pigs. All of the animals are for the most part in the care of the county, as is the guy that lived here. The mess of old animal crates, trash, old clothes, and miscellaneous garbage spreads from one end of the property to the next. The tenant of this house is in the Bullock County Detention Center, and the guy who says he is the property owner doesn't want to talk about the mess or talk about anything, really. We went to the house with questions, and this is how we were treated. I'll have that camera tear it all pieces if you don't get the hell out of here. You mean that? I'll grab that and tear it I all pieces. I wouldn't if I were you. Yes, I will, too. You touch. Are get you out of here. A Bullock County Sheriff's deputy was called, and we did talk to him. And he said we did the right thing by leaving. The guy that lived in this house in Shepherdsville was arrested on July 17th for possession of drugs and firearm charges. Most of the neighbors declined to talk to us out of fear, except for one guy who said that we should call him Alan. I'm still in the neighborhood, you know, where there's probably still friends. Over the past couple of years, Alan says the animal collection across the street grew slowly. The obvious is a little bit of a, a sight sore, especially with, I think he probably had 12, 13 roosters out front, the little farm, little uh, zoo he had in the, in the backyard. Eventually, the animals dominated the house and the property. By one count from a neighbor that has been helping care for the animals, there were 20 to 30 dogs and cats, 60 chickens, 50 or so pigeons, 50 rabbits, a dozen goats, and a few horses and a lot of small pigs. The domestic animals are in the shelter, and many of the rabbits, chickens, and pigeons are living a new life in the wild. And at least one pig is still roaming the neighborhood. He came in the yard, uh, and my dog... Uh Barked at him through the door and chased him off. Uh, I believe he was over there for a while. I've seen him walk down the road. And we saw what we believed to be that one pig run into the woods. He's got a good belly. The Bullock County Animal Control Office told me that they plan to file additional charges against the former tenant. The property owner is left with a mess to clean up. I always hope for good neighbors. Which the neighbors told me is a long time past due. With photojournalist Zebonique Petty, Richard Essex, WDRB News.